field of education is changing. Instead of receiving our education during the first 20 to 25 years of our lives from recognized institutions, we are becoming lifelong learners who learn from a variety of sources and MOOCs can be one of them. This is a more modular, more flexible approach and it is an answer to the developments in our society. Our current society requires a more flexible workforce. At the same time, technological developments, such as increased internet connectivity and mobile devices, have partly changed the modes of delivery of education, from books and physical lectures to education through a variety of media and on a variety of devices. These developments enable us to further personalize our education. A complicating factor is that in this situation it is more difficult for an employer to evaluate what an applicant has learned and which skills he or she has developed. When education is offered by a recognized institution that offers accredited programs, a government or another regulatory body has evaluated and approved uh, the program. Furthermore, students need to have certain entry levels to be admitted to the program. This demonstrates that a graduate from such a program has also passed the entry qualifications. With this unbundling process, the need arises for another way to obtain an indication of the skills of a person, for instance an applicant. One way uh, that this is tackled is through ID verification and proctoring of exams. As an additional service in MOOCs, uh, the student's ID can be verified by comparing the pic picture on the student's ID by the image of the person on the webcam. Another way to check the identity of the student taking the exam is to analyze the student's typing pattern. Um, exams can be proctored in a classical classroom setting. Uh, and another way is to proctor an exam online. The exam location is inspected by a camera and the video of the exam is recorded and reviewed. Uh, in the examples in the next section, you will see a variety of developments where MOOCs are used for campus credit.